How epic is that video? Oh my god, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I killed it. <laughs> I'm gonna get hired as a photographer after this. <laughs> Ace is gonna yell at us. <laughs> <laughs> Burning the ice. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's exactly what he's gonna say. <laughs> what an animal! Sam is devouring it. Of that monster. I told him, hey, don't shoot it. That is Ace not is going to be mad. That is the opposite of what happened. I was all like, man, I don't know. That's a big I was like, fish. Come film me swimming with this fish. He was like, bro, <laughs> smoke saw, I smoked, smoked whatever. I've got, I got the pork fat. I got the pork fat, bro. <laughs> 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 Seventy pounder. What? A freaking fish. Unbelievable fish, absolutely monster. The true, like, just true monster fish of Hawaii out here. Unbelievable. You're saying they don't have cigatera on this side of the island? Um, Mo I've never experienced any, and we'll eat them from this side, from small to big. Eat them from this side, all sides. The other side, on the other side, you're more worried about cigatera and stuff because of the reef. Yeah. Wow. Freaking cool fish. Epic, man. That's a beauty. Congrats, dude. I promise you guys a catch and cook, and that's what we're doing. First, I gotta get it out of the cooler. Oh my god. Get out of the cooler. Clean it up. I don't even know how to hold this thing, bro. I'll have the audience know that Ryan had to carry the buckets half full yesterday because he couldn't carry a full bucket. And that was a full bucket is about 40 pounds. So it, he peaks at it about 25. So um, I'll bring the scale closer for you, right? <laughs> I can use that is a little heavier than 25 pounds. So he might be peaked out. I can usually tell what a fish is 50 because I can't carry it. <laughs> this one's more than 50. Stop! He needs to eat his protein. This YouTube channel doesn't know me that well yet, <laughs> but I'm like the weakest person ever. <laughs> Well, the weakest link. He wasn't the weakest link yesterday. Right, he put so fish on the boat. Right, so where are the guesses? I guess 67 pounds. I got 63. I have 68. One pound more. <laughs> this is Price this is, is right. Price. Yeah, exactly. Look at this guy! He probably just lost two pounds because he just dropped it on his head. You need some help, Brian? Okay, it's teared. It's at zero. Yes. Oh. Ah. Whoa! Ryan wins at 69! Wow! 69! So we're gonna fillet him up, take the good parts off of him, and then uh, I was always told 
whatever you don't use you give back so we're gonna keep the head we're gonna throw the head back in the ocean so the crabs and lobsters and everything like that can eat away at it and so uh, we can continue the circle of life um, but the meat we're gonna grind it up mix it with some pork fat put in some pork casings and smoke it in the Traeger heck yeah I'm stoked okay now I gotta get it over there <laughs> I'm gonna put the camera down and help him out I'm gonna pull some nice fillets off it like I said we're looking for the a-grade stuff here I mean that's a monster fish turn it into sausage it should be awesome we're gonna take the back loins, the bottom. We're gonna kind of stay away from the belly because if there was cigatari, it's gonna stick to the head and to the belly area. So we'll stick to the back fillet and that lower uh, loin um, from the anal fin back. And uh, we'll cube that up and uh, make it into sausage. Do you know where the anal fin is, right, Ryan? Yeah. I know where that anal fin is. Hold on, let me help him. I, it took me two minutes and the knife was taken away from me. Two minutes, guys. This thing's a monster. You tried to just split up through the ribs, it wasn't happening. Now we're gonna like kind of put in a quarter, kind of like you would with a big tuna or something. All right guys, so we're back here again. We've gathered all of our ingredients. We've done a little research. We know a little bit more than we did before and we're ready to make this a Lewis sausage. What are we doing first here, Justin? So the last time we were here, we filleted the fish. So now it's in big chunks. And now we're gonna try and we're gonna dry it off, try and get as much of that water off of it so it doesn't come into like a mush. And then we're gonna cut into smaller cubes. We got our pork fat. So we're gonna grind this, grind that, put it in this bad boy here. It's gonna come up here, we're gonna season it. And then we'll put the coice casings on. And then we're gonna smoke it. And then we're gonna smoke it, and the best thing to do while you're waiting for it to smoke? Yeah. Eat fried cola. Done. We got our meat grinder here. This is like the greatest meat grinder of all time. It's like a one and a half horsepower. Shout out to the guys over at Meats. And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the, the olua, this beautiful looking olua, and we're gonna add in pork fat from my brother's pork um, at Kaunamano Farm. So this is local, Hawaii raised pork. So we're gonna mix that to a ratio of two parts fish to one part pork, and then we're gonna mix in all the goods. So let's start your engines. Oh! Bro, this thing is cruising. Yeah. Guys, this is gonna be freaking epic. I don't know what I'm <laughs> expecting, but, but man, this is a serious, this is a serious operation. It's gonna take as long to clean this thing than it did to grind this stuff. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna flavor it, then we're gonna mix it, and then we're gonna fry a little bit of the mix to make sure that it tastes okay before we stuff it. So we're just gonna add some paprika, because we said that makes pretty colors. See, now when I, when I said that we had done our research, I meant that we had done a little bit of research. <laughs> when he said research, we know that it's possible. <laughs> as in we know that other people do this, and it turns out, Good, but <laughs> you have exact proportions there of what? Yeah. <laughs> so I read this recipe. It looks like a lot, but we probably put 15 pounds of fish, pork, and when all those fails, put soy sauce. <laughs> now we get to get our hands dirty! Yay! Guys, we decided that worst case scenario, we wanted to look good. <laughs> You, you taste with your eyes before you taste with your tongue, right? So, <laughs> it's all about presentation. It looks epic, man. It does, it really, really does. It really looks epic. So I'm gonna take a little clump, and we're gonna go fry that upstairs. All right, Justin, what's the verdict? It's actually pretty good. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. No, Sam, it's awesome. Is this okay? Okay. I'm shocked. Yeah. Right? Wow. 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 Bro. Dude, you did it. 
It's the ultimate test right here. Here, yummy. So sucky eating. Yeah. Um. Mm. Okay. Is that taste good? Good. Yummy? Yummy? Yeah. It is L approved, guys. Now we're gonna go smoke this stuff and pack it. Now you've never done this before. I've done, I've made pork sausage before. Okay. But I've never made fish and I'm always the bystander. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch you, you it. You do what I'm doing. So this is the first time, yes, that I have ever. Which you've been in charge. Nice. Yes. Okay, so now we got fish all the way to the end. I'm gonna pinch the top. Tie it in a knot. So since we're gonna lay it down on the grill, it doesn't need to be um, tied with string or anything like that because most sausages get hung in a smokehouse. Uh, and then they would. And then you have to do it tied with a string, so there's a hard part. So since we're just gonna make small links like this, we should be good. Okay, stop. We're gonna need string. <laughs> I don't um, know how I'm gonna tie it otherwise. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know the proper tying technique. So we don't really know what we're doing. Can we use any string? Can we use some Dyneema freaking <laughs> real line? That last video I said you could make anything, anything with, with anything with the line off your spear gun. Yeah, we're gonna need the Dyneema. <laughs> Sam, do you want to Google how to tie your sausage? <laughs> Measure off another. I pinch it and twist it. So we've got two. That, pinch it, twist. And now it twists towards me. I've had a little sausage before, and people always, you know, Everybody's everybody has their secret sausage mix or whatever. And, uh, but I think, you know, we're all learning here. We should have used a little bigger chunk one so the fish chunks were bigger so it wasn't as as Vienna sausagey. <laughs> but uh, I'm pretty pumped right now, I'm not gonna lie. No, I mean it tasted great, we tested it, I mean, I've, I'm impressed. Color looks good, I mean it was good before we smoked it. Anything you put on the Traeger, I've seen Justin put insane things on the Traeger and make them edible. Except for the abalone. The abalone <laughs> was not edible. <laughs> we were in Fort Bragg and he just takes some abalone and puts it on the Traeger and I guess that was not how it should be done. <laughs> Does every Lua die now or what? <laughs> that was a lot of work. <laughs> I'm not gonna complain next time I buy it for $20 on the side of the road, that's for damn sure. <laughs> we got a rupture! Well, that's gonna be a patty. <laughs> How's that for an Alua catch and cook? All right, catching stuff, the cooking's coming. We got this thing preheated to like 180. We're gonna put them on until, uh, the scientific term is, till they look done, according to Justin. <laughs> okay, Woo. say goodnight. The sausage is in the Traeger, and now we have a long time to wait. So I brought over some of these coles that I just got. We're gonna fry some of these up. Justin pulled out some OP from the depths of his freezer, and uh, we're gonna have a feast while we sit here and wait for these. You ready? Set? Go! Wow. Looks pretty yummy. Looks pretty awesome. I mean, can I eat it? Is it cooked or want to? Hey, hey, yeah. do it some more. Let's try it. If we get trigonosis, we get trigonosis together. Cheers, Ryan. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> that is really good. Notice how I waited for him to eat it first. <laughs> Bro! That is edible. We what? definitely ground it too fine, guys. It's got we'll definitely, yeah. definitely the wrong texture, but it's close. It's not. It's not far off. I think we need to shoot another lua and try again. I agree, guys. I'm shocked. <laughs> I don't know why he's shocked. I'm shocked because I've seen Justin cook before, and his wife and family are much better cooks. All Justin has is a Traeger, and the Traeger seems to make everything delicious. <laughs> That's, I, that's Justin's secret. I have to concur to that though. <laughs> Are they good? That's better than I thought it would be. Thank you so, so much for watching this video. 
This was epic. We shot that Alua. It took us a little bit, but we smoked him up, made sausage. Sam is devouring it. That was really good. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. We've got so much more coming for you. See you guys next time on Ryan Myers Expeditions.